Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to free up 30 GB plus of disk space on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 in just one minute. So make sure that you apply all these steps carefully. Do not skip any part because every part is very important. And after applying all the solution, if you successfully able to free up the space, please consider subscribing to the channel, like the video. And still, if you have any question, then let me know in the comment section. So the first thing that we will do is we will find out that how much currently we have the free space on our C drive. So open your file explorer. Go to this PC. And right now you can see it says 178 gigabyte free or 476 GB. So what we will do, we will write down somewhere like 178 GB. And once we will be done, we will see that how much space has been free out after applying all the solution. Now you can minimize this, close it. Now on your Windows 10 or Windows 11, right click on the Windows icon and choose settings. Now click on system. Then from the left hand menu option, click on storage. And here you will find local disk C and this will display that how much data, how much space has been occupied by different a feature of windows like apps and feature they are occupying around 133 gigabyte of space other 56 then your desktop 28 gigabyte temporary file 21.6 gigabyte and if you click show more categories you will see that videos is 207 mb then mail which is not occupying too much space so what we will do we will try to free out the space from here this is the best way so what you can do, you can click on temporary file first and look over here that what kind of space has been occupied. Like whenever you download anything from your internet, then it, those files go to your download. This can be any kind of application, software, videos, a movies, anything. So if you do not need them, so you can check that box and then you can go for thumbnails, Microsoft Defender Antivirus you can also check this box then there is a temporary file and then there is a delivery optimization file and probably you also see windows update file so that basically is the old update file you can also check that box because that occupy a lot of space once you are done you just need to check all the boxes that you want to delete and then choose remove files okay so if you click remove file it will take some time and after that, it will give you some message finished temporary file cleanup. So this process will take time according to the space that has been occupied. If you are trying to free up a space that is around 20, 15, 30 gigabyte, then it may take some time. So please have some patience and wait until this has been completed. Once you are done with this, close it. Now from your keyboard, press Windows and R key to bring up the run box at the left hand corner. Type here temp. Then hit enter. Now here you have to delete all these files. So press Ctrl A to select all. Then press delete key or shift plus delete key to delete them all. Then click on yes. Now you can check this box. And then click on escape. Close it. Again press Windows R key to bring up the run box. Type percent. Temp. Percent. Then click on OK. Again, press Ctrl A to select all, then press the shift and delete key all together, then click on yes. Rest, you can check this box and click on escape. Once done, you can close it. Again, press Windows R, type prefetch, P-R-E-F-E-T-C-H, then click on OK. Press Ctrl A to select all, then press shift and delete key to delete them all. Now once you are done, from the left hand side, click on this PC. Then click on local disk C, right click on it. Then choose properties. And here you will see an option of disk cleanup. Click on it. This will calculate the space that can be free out. And this will be showing you the same file, but still I recommend that you should also follow the steps from here. You can choose the file that you want to delete. Then click on OK. Then click on delete files. So this will take some time and next what you have to do open your file explorer again then double click on local disk c 
and now on the right hand side you will see search file click on that file and here you have to type a command that will display all the heavy file all kind of file that is occupying a huge space on your c drive so what you have to type here in capital size then double dot that is colon i'm not sure what do you say that and then you have to type gig and antic gigantic and then hit on enter now this will take some time and it will find out all the heavy file that is occupying a lot of space and that will display over here so depending what we need and what we don't then we will just clean that we will delete it so now the scan has been completed and it shows windows 11.vmdk and that is occupying around 28 gigabyte so this is a vmware file i use basically windows 11 on my vmware machine so i will leave it then we have a windows no editor.pak so what we can do we can delete this i don't think we need it then we have windows 11 english iso file so that is around 5.18 gigabyte i have already used it so i don't need it so what i will do right click on it and choose delete okay once done we have another file here that we will also delete so just delete it and then we have this one that is uh, downloading hotter content pack tower of fantasy i don't need it so i will also delete it so once you are done with the deleting you can minimize this now click on the search box of your windows 10 or 11 and type here optimize and from the suggestion choose defragment and optimize drives and here it will display the drive so basically our intention is to free up the space so right now it's showing the d drive here so you can click on analyze then click on optimize and this will basically if there is a way to clean up some space this will surely optimize it okay then click on close and after that you also need to uninstall all kind of application and program that basically you don't need so how you have to do on your windows search type appwiz.cpl then hit enter and now this will display the list of all the application program installed on your computer so look for the application if you're not sure about anyone then you can look for that in the search box keep scrolling down like this i don't need exit lag version anymore and you can see it's occupying around 66 mb so i need to click on uninstall then click on yes then it has been uninstalled similarly you have to look for all the application that you don't need so just look for them uninstall it keep scrolling down until you find all the application and programs that is not for your use so you can see there are lots of games that i don't use but they have been installed so you can also uninstall them okay once you are done with this close it now the second thing is that open your file explorer and look for the file that you don't need okay whichever file you don't need some like look in your pictures look in your documents look in your attachments look in your downloads look in your another drive so whatever files are there you don't need just go ahead and delete it especially from the downloads you can see that there is a huge download here that is occupying a lot of space and if you do not need it kindly go ahead and just delete those files that you don't need okay similarly go to your local disk c go to program files and sometime after uninstalling the software these files remain in the c drive of program file okay so look here that whichever folder whichever application you have already uninstalled you don't need it just go ahead and uninstall from here as well i mean you have to delete it just right click on it and choose delete once you are done you also need to delete everything from the recycle bin so how you have to do look for recycle bin and whichever file is here just delete that and once you are done close it now these all steps that you have applied will surely clean a lot of space and free up a lot of space on your c drive on your computer 
and then last that i also recommend you that try to use your cloud drive like for your google drive your one drive and try to store the application or file on your drive instead of your computer so that's all guys now if i go back and check by this pc you can see it says 208 gigabyte okay so after restart it will surely uh, increase so still previously it was around 178 now it's around 208 and we can see that around 30 gigabyte space has been free out okay i can free much more space because i have left download and many other things and if i just delete them then it will surely increase so right now i have increased 30 gigabyte of a space and you probably you can increase this space you can just free up more space by following the step that i have explained in this video so that's all guys for today hopefully this video will surely help you to improve the performance increase and free up the space on your c drive on your computer and if this worked for you please consider subscribing to the channel like the video still if you have any question let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye